How to boost FPS and performance on a Windows PC in under three minutes. Go to the search bar and type in Control. Select Control Panel, go to System and Security, now select System again, and from here we're going to select Advanced System Settings. Now go to Performance Settings and make sure it's adjusted for best performance by clicking Apply and OK. Now we're going to back out and I want you to select Gaming and go to Game Mode and make sure this is turned on to optimize your PC for play by turning things off in the background. Next, go to Windows Update and make sure you're running the latest drivers. After you've done that, you can exit out of this. And now we're gonna go back to the search bar and type in Power. Select Edit Power Plan. And now we're gonna go to Power Options. So from here, make sure you're running high performance as this favors performance but may use more energy. Now back out. Right click on the desktop and go to show more options. Now select NVIDIA control panel if you have it. Once we're here, the first thing we're going to change is under adjust image settings with preview and make sure this is turned all the way on to performance. Next, go to manage 3D settings and this is going to be dependent on what your situation is. In most cases, you want it turned off or prefer maximum performance. Now back out of this and we're just going to go to no. Now we're going to go to Google and I want you to type in Windows PC Manager. Now this is from Microsoft and click on it and we're going to download the Microsoft PC Manager and it only takes a few minutes. Once you've done that, open up the PC Manager and what I'm going to show you is how to boost your PC's performance all in one area. So you can see right now I have about 200 megabytes in temporary files. Earlier this morning it was 4 gigs. We're going to press boost and it's going to do all the work for us. There's also health check, storage management to make storage sense and perform cleanups, as well as offering process management to close anything you're not using, in addition to turning off startup apps to make sure your PC runs faster when you first turn it on. It also offers free security scanning if you'd like. Like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.